Some people are surprised by this, but Amish in a number of communities have southern accents. And some people may find this video randomly, uh, not knowing me, and think I'm making fun of this in some way, and nothing could be further from the truth because, you know, even though people say <laughs> I have a kind of a weird accent, probably because I've traveled a lot, having myself grown up in the South, I love a Southern accent. You know, it feels like home to me. So I just wanted to share a small visit I had to an Amishman in North Carolina. Now, the people in this community have roots in the Etheridge, Tennessee settlement, which is about the strongest Southern accent I've found among the Amish. This would be Enos Gingrich, and he runs a patio furniture shop. This was a fun visit. I hope you enjoyed this little snippet of my conversation with Enos. You got you do some skiing up here too, huh? No, it's <laughs> not very apt. <laughs> is that for Cherry Mountain over here or is that? No, no the okay. kids they've tried it a little bit. We ain't much of skiers. <laughs> I see, I see. Well, have them handy just in case. That's okay, this my card. your card. And this is my brother-in-law's card. He's making leather. Okay. This is Henry Miller. Okay. Henry oh, that's Miller. A, okay. That's a new one. He just moved in. And here's a new prize sheet, which was the lumber prizes. Okay. These prizes are liable to change any any day. <laughs> gotcha. Gotcha. So this is gliders. There's your information right there. So you got the sons on board too, right? Yeah. Who's who's the hardest worker in the family? I don't know. Both of them work about the same. <laughs> the oldest one, he's more to go at it and okay. Try to get it get it done quick. <laughs> okay. Always has good results. Uh, pretty good. Pretty he good. sometimes he gets a little too fast on it, and he might get a screw sticking out somewhere. So sure, <laughs> that that's why you're here for quality control, right? I tried to. <laughs> <laughs> he does good though. I can't complain. <laughs> okay, that's good. That's good. So I hope you enjoyed that quick visit with Enos. I'll be showing you some more of his patio furniture shop in another video. This is just another illustration of how the Amish are not a one-size-fits-all culture. And you even see regional differences in the way they live, in their culture, and so on. They live among other non-Amish Americans that have that accent when they speak English. That also can influence how they speak English. Also showing they're not, you know, isolated within their own bubbles. I also had a video on his wife's soap shop, which you can check out here. So thanks for watching. If you like this video, hit the like button for me, and I'll talk to you next time.